How's it going, everybody? My name is Ten, and welcome to Red Tape. Um, I was scrolling through Steam, trying to figure out what game I could replace Wolfenstein with, and this one looked pretty interesting. Um, it's not a very long game, but uh, I think uh, in the reviews for this game, I think it's said that it was only about 90 minutes or two hours, depending on how you decide to play it. Uh, I don't know what that means. So yeah, uh, buckle up, hit like, subscribe, all that stuff. We're looking for 500 subs by the end of the year, and there will be a Q&A uh, when we hit 500 subs. That'll be the 500 sub special. So if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below or on my social medias, and I will try to incorporate as many questions as I can. Um, so yeah. <sighs> Good coffee and are you sure you want to start a new game? Well, I don't exactly have it. When an angel falls, loving the biblically accurate uh, angel. <laughs> it's very interesting. Hell Inc. It can be very disorienting. Okay. But don't worry, we're here to help. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just remember these three tips, okay? Tip one, follow your boss's commands. Do not question a <laughs> It's a fly. That's amazing. Tip two, be productive. Okay. Work as if your life depends on it. Oh, all right. Tip three, help others. Help, hey guys, hey, help me torture this guy. <laughs> if it's hard, just remember. Okay. Yeah, we're very familiar with Doom on this channel. Don't be lazy. Obey your masters. Offer your help. Maintain organization. Ooh, all right. Cool. Work well, you're in hell. Hell, Inc. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is cute so far. It's really cute. Okay. All right, we're in the game, and my, of course, my cursor is an upside-down cross. That is hilarious. Let's explore. Work, don't stall. Okay, hell, ink. A uh, bunch of books. Uh, I don't know what painting that is. <laughs> Corporate demon. Okay. Oh, the TV is broken again. Flimsy old thing. Huh? Where am I? What am I doing here? All of that would have been all of that would have been would have been answered in the video. Who are you? Well, let me try to fill you in. Hello, my name is Virgil, and you are in hell. Thank you, Virgil. What? But I'm an angel. I can't be here. Technically, not anymore. <clears throat> what do you mean? You fell. It can't be. I was in heaven, then everything went dark, and well, you must have got the game master really pissed. Not only did you fall, but you're marked high priority. But this ain't right. I need to talk to someone. I don't belong here. Oh, you new demons always say that. When you were betraying the Game Master, you didn't think about the consequences, did you? I never betrayed him, and I'm not a demon. Well, I have no say on this. I'm only here to help you in your adaptation process. The thing is, you were an angel, you fell, and now you're a, and now you're a Hell Inc. employee. <coughs> I think that's all the video said. This is not right. Well, keep your protest to yourself. What you need what you need to do now is lose this angel form and be registered as a demon. But I don't want to. I want to talk to your superior. And you will, but you need to do as I say first. And what is that? To start, you'll need to leave this room and follow the corridor until you get to the registration room. <clears throat> okay, but this ain't over. I'm sure it isn't. Be registered. Okay, I could do that. I got water, water jugs, water, little water dispensers in hell. Little bathroom. Can I see myself? Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> that's really cool. Can I open any of these? No. Okay. That's so cool. You can actually see my reflection and how I, and when I strafe, like it actually tracks. That's really cool. Okay. Hell Inc. Oh, there's a bunch of dudes. Or, it, there's three at least. Okay. Ugarit? Is that what your name is? Hey, you must be here to get a demon name, right? 
I guess so. Actually, I wanted to talk to the boss of this place. You probably want to talk to the director, but you can't do that without a name, can you? I'm pretty sure I can. No, you can't. Silly thing. <clears throat> now be a nice demon and create a name for yourself. Remember, it must be very devilish and scary. Very devilish and scary? Oh, do I have to... Do I write the name? Okay, cool, cool, cool. I was really hoping I wasn't going to have to like write with this pen. <laughs> oh, God, what do we want our name to be? Um, <clears throat> uh, we'll do... Um, Mr. Uh, no. No. We'll do Sam. We'll just call him Sam for Samael. <laughs> one of I would love to imagine the left hand of God being the one sent to hell. Yep, name is Sam. Name is Sam. Oh wait, was there more that you could say? Okay, since you have a name now, you only need a physical form. You can get that with uh, with Emar. He's at the table across from me. Okay, cool. Hell, welcome to your new job. <laughs> hey there, you must be here to get your demon, your demonic form, right? No, I'm an angel. Not anymore, you aren't. Now you are. Now you are a demon, and you must look like one. This form of yours is too abstract. My head hurts. But I just need to talk to the superior here. First, get this physical form. Then you can talk to him. Oh, I have a hand. I am I. Wait, I wanted to go look at myself in the mirror. Dang it. Okie dokie. Now go talk to Virgil again, and he's right there next to the. Oh god, next to the door. What up, dude? Nice. It's so good to see you, nice and registered. How do you like your new demon form? I hate it. I want to talk to your superior now. You can do that now. Just walk across the hall and into the door on the right. You can't miss it. I'm going to fix this misunderstanding once and for all. Welcome to your new job. I got a little achievement. Welcome to Red Tape. This is amazing so far. I love the art style. I love the... Uh, yeah, I can't read that. <laughs> I can't read any of that. Okay. No, I, I love this. This is a very interesting game so far. Aristotle! All right. Hi, how can I help? Hey, I'm new here. I'm an angel. Wow, that's cool, I guess. I want to know how I can get out of here. You can't. You're stuck here. We're all stuck here. You don't seem happy about it either. I'm not. I hate it here. I hate this job. I've been here for more than a thousand years. That's sad. Yeah, I got used to sadness. Oh, jeez. Okay, then, where's the director's office? It's behind you on the left. Thanks! Behind me on the left. I'm guessing it's the only open door. Are you the... Oh, Beelzebub. Hey there, you must be the new kid. Your name is Sam, right? Yeah, I think so. So, what are your expectations for working in hell? I... None, I'm not working here. I'm an angel. Oh, I see. You're in demon denial, right? No, because I'm not a demon. I didn't deserve to fall. Look into my eyes, friend. Do you think anyone here deserved to fall? The demons of hell are hardworking. I bet they work 100 times harder than any angel you know. You think you don't deserve hell? It's hell that doesn't deserve you. But I didn't betray anyone. It doesn't matter. You're here now, and there's no way to go but down. Which means that if you play by Hell's rules, you might be promoted and get a better position here. But what would a better position do for me? Well, your current position as a low-level employee. If you want to get similar or more power than you had as an angel, then you must earn it. You have a good career here, kid. You only have to work for it. And how can I do that? Well, that's what I was going to tell you. As your first task, it would be good for you to know your way around hell. Explore a little bit. Do this, go to the sector's floor, talk, sect this floors, talk to the directors, see what kind of help they need. This sector? Yeah, this floor and the next two. Not that you would be able to access the others with the permissions you have now. What do you mean? 
There's a magic seal in the elevator that keeps you from accessing the floors that your role does not have permission to go to. But for now, you won't have to think about it. Just go back and talk to Virgil and to the directors of the second and third floors. Did you get all of that? Yeah, talk to Virgil. Talk to the second and third floor directors. I think so. Okie dokie. When you talk to them and help them, ask them to sign this letter of recommendation. Then bring it back to me, alright? Okay. Your future in this company will be bright, kid. Believe me. Cool. I got registered. I am now Sam, the fallen angel. Uh, Beelzebub's promotion. That's the new task. Okay. So I have to go back to Virgil, and then I have to go talk to the second and third floor directors. Okay. Hey there. Did hell already sink in? No. I'm still going to find a way to, pr to prove my place isn't here. You new demons. It's always a delight to talk to you. So, what can I do to help? It seems like I need to help you and get your signature on this recommendation letter. Can I help you in any way so you can sign this? No, you've already done enough for me. With your tantrum. Here, here it is. Thank you. You're welcome. Come visit, come visit me once you get used to the place. Okay, cool. So now I have to go to the second and third floors. I'm guessing that's the elevator. Do I... What floor am I on? I guess I'm on the first one? Yeah, it would make sense that I'm on the first one. That looks like a reception office. Like a lobby. <sighs> Little sip of the coffee. <clears throat> keep me, keep me alive. What you got going on? Oh, I can jump! Can I crouch? Something about... Fofoka Magazine? Social media? Oh, they got social media down in hell? Oh, jeez. Cleopatra. I need to find the manager. Bartender. <laughs> What's a demon gotta do to get some alcohol around here? Sorry, kid. We ain't open yet. Check back some other time. I don't know why I decided to give them all New York accents. I'll try to switch it up. Okay. Or like Jersey accents. Narcissus. Oh, this ought to be fun. Hey, I, I need to see the manager of this department. You must be the new kid. As you can see, the heads of this department are currently indisposed. You may answer to me for your tasks. Fine, but if I do, can you sign this letter of recommendation for me? If you do your job right, then maybe I will. What should I do then? Let's start with something simple. Even something even you can handle. I'm gonna I might give him a different voice. <coughs> nah, whatever, it works. Make me a copy of this document. It's impossible to screw this up. Yeah, okay. Um new task, office gossip. Aishma and Deva. Just shut up already! I hate you so much! Oh, it's very mutual. Um hello? Go to hell! We already are in hell, you stupid idiot! They don't even notice me. Okay. <clears throat> okay, there's gotta be a copy room somewhere around here. Hello! Samson. Oh yeah, with the long, beautiful hair. No time to chat. Need to make a copy, I guess. Cool. Uh, that was very fast. That is a very fast copy, copy machine. That is amazing. Here you go. Finally! Let me see. Oh my god, I was wrong. You somehow managed to screw this up. This is the worst copy I've ever seen. Nope, do it again. I can't accept this. Here, try again. Faster this time. I don't have all day. Okay, yeah. Uh, I don't know that I have a sprint. I don't know that I would be allowed to sprint in the office, but I can work pretty fast. Alright, cool. Doing it again, doing it again, doing it again. Alright, I was faster this time. Give me that. Wow, a five-year-old could make a better copy. Just wow. You know what? Forget it. I'll have Samson do it. I'm honorary head of department, not intern babysitter. Go see if anyone else needs anything. I don't care. So, I, I made two copies for you and you, you still... Okay. No, that's fine. That's okay. No, I get it. I get it. No, that's cool. Cupid? <laughs> Narcissus giving you a rough time, huh? How'd you know? He's been giving everyone a rough time. Ever since he got himself the role of honorary head of department. 
More like stole himself that role. I'm Cupid, by the way. Wait, the real Cupid? The god of passionate desire? What are you doing here? Well, Christianity is pretty popular nowadays. They're not a big they're not big fans of desire and erotic love. No, they are not. <laughs> Can't you fix this whole situation? Use your bow and arrow to make the bosses fall madly in love again? I could. Someone stole my bow though. Probably that Cleopatra. She's had it out for me since day one. I'll see what I can do. Go talk to this lady. Ardat? <laughs> Looking for work, babe? We can get a lot of work done together. Winky face. Sorry, not the kind of work I'm looking for. Yeah, no. Uh, I'm running a YouTube channel. I can't do that. Ooh, a hair trimmer. I have a hair trimmer. What am I doing with the hair trimmer? I hope she gets fired. What am I doing with this hair trimmer? Cupid's bow. Why would I want that dreadful old thing? I've had a lifetime of precious artifacts, honey. Unlimited riches. Pretty petty thievery. It's not my style. But I heard a juicy rumor. That Ardat has been acting quite suspicious. Oh, I just talked to Ardat. I think. Yeah, this is Ardat. I know that you stole Cupid's bow. Aw, oh, you found me out. Are you gonna arrest me? Put me in handcuffs? Slam me against the wall? Please, stop. Yeah. Just give it back. I really need it. Oh, I don't have it. What? But you said... Come on, babe. We were just playing, weren't we? Unless you really want to cuff me up, slam me against the... Okay, yeah, that's enough. Got any leads for me? Anyone who might have stolen the bow? Killjoy. I don't know. Eidlu seems like he'd do something like that. Maybe he did it. I don't care. Eidlu? I don't know who that is. I don't know who Eidlu is. Why do I have a hair trimmer? Okay, can't go through that door. Narcissus is in here. And these lovely specimens are fighting. Just shut up already. I hate you so much. Oh, it's fair. Oh, it's, it's just... Yeah, it's the same text. That's... That's funny. <clears throat> oh, we haven't been in here yet. Are you Eidlu? Please tell me you have Cupid's bow. Uh -huh. Who the hell is Cupid? Uh -huh. And who the hell are you? Uh -huh. Sorry, but someone as great as me. Yeah, yeah, okay, just send me to the next person. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Samson was looking a bit on edge lately. That's good enough. I'll talk to him. Why do I have a hair trimmer? Yeah, Samson with the long, gorgeous hair. Samson, do you know who has Cupid's bow? I know. Okay, well, do you have any other... Wait, you know who has it? I do, but I won't tell you. Why not? It's none of your business. What are you going to do about it, little one? I could cut your hair. I think that's why I have this. I already told you I'm not... Oh my god, I guessed. <laughs> Uh, sorry. Why? Why did you? Why did you do this? This. This is a nightmare. Oh my god! Narcissus is never gonna look at me again. Oh my god! He cares so much about looks, and I'm a bald mess. You actually like that guy? I've been in love with him since I got here. Aww. I thought you'd know that already. Gossip runs wild on this floor. Yeah, I'm kind of new here. If I may ask though, what the hell do you even see in that guy anyway? I admire his confidence. He's a man who knows what he wants. He's very smart and incredibly cultured. He also he's also crazy hot. <laughs> he used to be kind too, but since this whole honorary head of department thing happened, I've been making copies all day. Why does he need so many copies? And why is he so picky about them? It's literally just a copy. I've been doing everything for him, and he didn't even thank me, not even once. He didn't even care that I kept his secret. What secret? He stole Cupid's bow. He didn't want them to reunite the bosses. Don't tell him I told you that. I'm tired of doing favors for him. I won't keep his stupid secret anymore. All right. Cool. Um, That's why we had the hair trimmer. I guess we'll go talk to Narcissus. Here we go. Oh, it's the intern again. What did you manage to screw up this time? I know you have the bow. Give it up. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. 
I used to have time for ridiculous office gossip back when I was a lowly employee like you. Now I have more important things to take care of. Now scram, go find something actually useful to do. Um, you have the bow. That's... Stay away from me. Alright, do you guys... Yeah, you loop again. <laughs> this is a very charming game so far. Um... I'm really close to finding out who stole your bow. Samson seems to know, but he won't tell me. Figures. He doesn't really engage in gossip or anything, really. He just follows Narcissus around like a lost puppy. I'm pretty sure there's something going on there. Narcissus's desk is in this room. Maybe there's something to find there. Um, is it here? Is this what you're... Ah. Uh, um, is this it? Huh. He said that the, his desk is in this room, but like, is this his desk or is this your desk? Our dat. Our dat. I'm clicking on stuff and I'm not getting a response. Water jug. Painting. Um. Could I talk to the barkeep? What's a demon got to do? Oh. Okay. Blood cooler? It's a water cooler, but it's red for some reason. Is this really water? Hey, can I borrow this mirror? Why do you... Actually, I get it. You look awful, honey. Like, absolutely terrible. I can't even look at you. Here, honey. You can have it. Be sure to bring it back. Um... Oh my god, what now? Oh. What do we have here? Who is this handsome devil? Oh, the things I'd do to you. Do you have the bow? Huh? Yeah. Can I have it back? Yeah, sure, whatever. Can't you see I'm busy here? Now, where were we? Oh, right. I was thinking about how beautiful you are. Oh, God. It's actually, actually narcissist. Here you go, Cupid. My bow! Oh, how I missed you. Did you break up their bickering? Not yet. It's okay. I give you permission to use the bow of passion just this once. You did help us out a whole lot. Oh, I gotta go, I guess, break up the ladies. Maybe if you weren't, maybe if you weren't so freaking stupid, you would, uh, why do you look so freaking hot right now? Oh, goodness. I, what were we even talking about? I have absolutely no idea. Do you want to, right here? Hell yeah. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Can I get your signature on this letter of recommendation? I'm trying to get promoted. Sure, whatever. Show me this letter. Very nice. Okay, now I guess we'll go return this. <laughs> My bow. Oh, how I missed you. Did you break? Not yet. It's okay. Uh, you did help us at all. Oh, I guess I, I didn't finish breaking up their, their bickering. Come on, hurry up, show me the letter. Um, oh, oh, okay. There you go. Now just stay away from this office for the next six hours or six hours. We're gonna be busy with some very important work. Also, please give this bow back to Cupid. I don't trust you running around with it, with something like that. Oh, okay, yeah, no problem. You sure you don't want to close those curtains? Or y'all the voyeuristic type? Okay, find the bow. Did you do it? Yeah. Finally, some peace and quiet. You can now work in peace. You do know that we don't need to do any work around here, right? The thought you'd have picked up on this by now. I had my suspicions. Here's your bow, by the way. All right. Cool. We we got we got we got some cool stuff done. Um, I'm gonna go stand by the water cooler and try to look inconspicuous. Um. But I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. And uh, if you're new around here, please subscribe. We're trying to see 500 subs before the end of the year. And there will be a Q&A video once we hit 500 subs. Um, so leave your questions in the comments below. And uh, until next time, remember the world doesn't need any help beating you down. So please be kind to yourselves and to each other. My name is Ten, and I'll catch y'all next time. This game is going to be good. I can feel it. Like